<laughs> it's funny that she does aerobics. That's an, I can't tell that she does. Hmm. Okay. Well. All right. Let's get out of here. Got my mushrooms. What? You don't have to type Dan D if I say something. What? Uh. All right, well, let's see. I will wait till tomorrow and we'll do that tomorrow. No, it's the wrong bin. No, it's not. That's the right bin. It's fine. We'll just do that tomorrow. All right, we have time. Well, I want to try to find the legendary winter fish. Glacier fish. It's... Cinder Sap Forest. So down there, anywhere down there. <laughs> anytime, any, anytime, any. Okay, so. All right, so let's. Get my bobber. Oh, it's already in there. Yep. Okay, let's go. I also got to... I need to check the uh, Adventurer's Guild, too. They open it, too. Is there any particular reason the MCs don't like you? Uh, it's not that they don't like me, they just don't know me yet. You gotta really invest a lot of time in game to uh, raise people's heart meters up. You gotta give them a gift every week, and then uh, two gifts every week, and also try to talk to them every day. Works best to focus on one or two characters at a time while you're doing that. Pick like two to three characters and then just constantly um, focus on them. A pike. Uh, talk to them each day raises their heart by point, point two, I think, a day. So if you just want a little extra boost, you can talk to them every day. But you can just give gifts too if you want. People like gifts. Okay, you, you're just being annoying now, ma'am. <laughs> uh, we are using bait and tackle in the rod itself. Legendary fish is in here someplace. Let's have to find them. Uh, we'll, you'll know when it's a legendary fish because the icon for the fish changes. It has a, like a little hat on and stuff. Um, 
one specific tile, southernmost tip, large island in the middle of the river. What? Oh, you have to stand right. Oh, I did not know that. I didn't know it only spawned in one spot. Yeah, it looks like it only spawns in one specific tile. and try to find him. So unless you happen to be standing on this tile over here, you would never know. Oh my fucking god! What in the hell? Oh my god, he's so annoying. <laughs> Whatever this fish is, very annoying too, but it's something different. Lingcod. Okay, that's. All right. I wonder if we can cook some fishing food. I, I don't think I have the ingredients for fishing food. Just have to deal with it. Okay, so that's not legendary fish. This is a fish that doesn't care. He's barely moving. Probably a chub. Yeah, link cods are very annoying. We're here for the legendary fish, though. Oh my god! Glacier fish! Woo! <laughs> Got the son of a bitch! <laughs> Holy damn! That fish was annoying! My god! <laughs> Woo! That was a legendary fight, alright. <laughs> that fish was just like. Broom, 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 broom. Oh my god. He, he's like a Gyarados. We should catch some squids for our, um... 
for our uh, fishing ponds. Let's go. It's starting to get nighttime, so let's go to the ocean. Um, the glacier fish builds a nest on the underside of glaciers. That fish was drinking G Fuel? Hey, it's my job to sell out, alright? Not yours. Yeah, I don't know. Apparently, it says it makes a fish nest. I don't know. Lots of fish out there. Maybe some make nests. Ah. Okay. Let's uh go try to get some squids. We need some... Are you playing video games? Once I gotta beat this level. Wait, Sam's a gamer? Hmm. Well, that might that put him back in the running. It's best to date a gamer when you are a gamer, so that way the other person understands. A non-gamer won't understand, you know, like that you're on the last boss of Dark Souls and your memory card is dead, so you got you can't save the game. You got to do it this run, or it's over. What mixed seeds? We'll try fishing room here for some squid. Right, try to get some squid. Squids are annoying too, but not nowhere near as annoying as that last thing we just the glacier fish. That glacier fish was insane. Albacore. That fish doesn't give a shit. Just like, what? Fine, catch me. I don't care. It's gonna lie here. And take it. Fun fact: puffer fish use the big Goron sword in Ocarina of Time. Did not know that, and I find that very suspicious. That that is an actual fact. That's kind of a sus fact. I don't know how I feel about that. <gasps> Squid! What quality? Only a gold star. We can do better than that. My fishing tackle's wearing out. Ooh, what's that? Seaweed, great. Okay, it definitely seems like a squid. Probably. Or an albacore. Keep it by the way. Albacore. Uh, Sneaky, thank you for the Prime Gaming sub. Oh, you're a first time ever sub. Well, we always ask, we'll try to ask, what is going to be your first ever sub emote? You're like, first one ever. Okay, that's probably an albacore. Actually, that's probably a squid, judging by that attack pattern. Yep. It's 
Good it equals calamari. Another herring. Yep. A diamond and some stone. Dan Yay! Ooh, good choice. Squid. Come on, squid. This definitely seems like a squid. Or not. <laughs> Hello, Vettis. It's going great. How you doing? Are there any bad choices with the first emo? Um... I gotta consult the documents. I don't think there's any bad emotes, so they're all good. So I don't think there is. So I think they're all good. Although if you pick Dan Evil, that means you're probably an evil person, which is probably not the best, but it's okay as long as you're cool. Albacore or squid? Albacore. Nope, halibut. Emphasis on butt. Hmm. Let's throw away the winter root, which we have quite a few of. Exactly, Monster Mike. There's no bad ones. Albacore? A perfect albacore. Um, having to throw, throw away the cockle. I don't think the cockle's worth much. This will probably be the last fish of the day. It was enough time to get home. Now, nah, one more squid. Come on, one more squid. Oh, I have a bait. I sh should put that on there. That's not a fish, though. Come on, one more squid. One more squid. That's a squid. Aha! It's another squid. Beautiful. Okay, let's go. I did get one more. <laughs> Check bush at 1230. What bush? You struggle with fishing? Um, I'm using a mouse, so I don't know uh, how it is with a controller, but the mouse is okay. I'm used to the mouse. There's a horse? There's always been a horse. We just gotta build it. Build a stable, I mean. We don't build the horse. Build the stable. Okay, we need to sleep. Nope, I need money first. Oh, God. Quickly. I need money for all those fish is caught. Okay, boom, boom, boom. Perch. Um, albacore, albacore, herring, herring, albacore, glacier fish, hold on to that, chub, pike, diamond, um, maybe bat, halibut, heh, <laughs> but, <laughs> uh, okay, quickly, go. 
to bed. Go to bed. Nope. Uh, cycle this quickly. Get him in there. Oh, in the bed. Run. Dive. I'm asleep. Whew. Okay, not bad. Ah, we're safe. Oh, it's Christmas Eve. <gasps> dun, 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 dun. <laughs> dun, 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 dun. Oh, we got cranberry jelly for days. And you need seven more to make even more. song. So comfy. That means Christmas tomorrow. I gotta figure out what she likes. We have some uh, wheat of it ready. 24 of it. Put that in the fridge. I can make just regular old bread too. Uh, my secret Santa is Marnie. Tomorrow's Feast of Wintervale, Marnie. Starts at 10, 9 a.m. in the town square. I Means tomorrow's a short day. Make her a farmer's lunch. Is that a good meal for her? Gift she likes, it's easy to make. Oh, I know that. I know you gotta put bait in the traps that don't have extra bait to spare right now. Okay, and boom. We'll see what we need what we need for our farmer's lunch again. Tifa! Good kitty. There was an egg on the bottom right. Oh, okay, I'll go back and grab it then. Sneaky eggs are sneaky. Love them all first. Okay, now we milk them. Them titties are full, I bet. Give them all some food. Don't worry, boys. Summer's al winter's almost over, and you guys can go frolic and eat the grass. Alright, let's put everything into here to make some delicious cheese. Okay, I gotta go grab that. She dead. I gotta go grab that uh, egg that I missed. Bottom right. Oh, there it is. Sneaky egg is sneaky. Well, let's go see what a farmer's lunch is and see if we can craft that. Maybe not. Hmm, farmer's lunch. Omelet and parsnip. I think I got one parsnip st stuck 
uh, stack, uh, put away in over here. I have one parsnip left. She better appreciate this. She better be so freaking grateful that I am like sacrificing my hard earned uh, income for her. My last parsnip. Well, we'll bring some milk in for some uh, omelets. Extra eggs. Pancakes. Ooh, delicious. Foraging. Okay, uh, omelets. And then farmer's lunch. That's going to be her gift for tomorrow. She better like it. Windows. <clears throat> trying to almost oh, we'll sneeze in. Nah, don't sneeze. Nah. Oh, before I forget, let's go to um, let's go build our uh, fishing pond. If I have, I've, I have all the things. Don't I hate pants? No, I like pants. I just hate when someone sneaks into your house at night and like get swaps all your pants with smaller pants and then puts the same size label on it so that way it looks like you got bigger, but really the pants are actually smaller. Happens all the time, unfortunately. It's a real problem nowadays. <laughs> Get that built. I know, people have been doing that. Work on your fish pond the day after tomorrow. I always take festivals off. Wow. You didn't even warn me. Miner's Crest Oak Presser. Furniture catalog, 200,000 bucks. Jeez. Yeah, you can make fish ponds now where you can get, make a uh, row. Row and caviar. Row is fish eggs. <coughs> did I miss, did I leave my horse? Whoops. Love my horse. I think we can stop by the Adventures Guild see if we get an upgraded sword somewhere. We have. Oh, we're getting really close to the next season. I got him. I got Chatty. Adventure is guilt time. Hopefully we can find something that's better. Lava Katana is 25,000 gold. That's the only better one that they have currently.
Space Boots. That is, that is a bit better. That's about double the steel falchion, but very, very rough. That's expensive. Let's see how we're doing on our bounties, though. Uh, nowhere even near with most of these. Need so many more of everything. Everything. <laughs> All right. There's a prismatic shard. One of the rarest items in the game. A treasure room. 25% chance for mystic stone in the mines. From mystic stone. That is the, uh, that one, yep. Yeah. Well, I guess we could pop it in the mine and try to, try to get one of those. If we can find one of those uh, rock things, that'd be good. If we get the prismatic shard, I think we can use that to get something. Remember, there's a powerful sword you can make with it or get with it. Just have to find it. Or what I'm looking for. We're looking for our, like a uh, purple rock. And if we find one, we have a very high chance of getting a one of them, but they are rare spawns themselves. Nope, none there. Uh, none of those. <laughs> lovely diamond is lovely. Um, nothing there. Yeah, we're just looking for something specific in here. We're not gonna quite farm, take out everything. We're just looking for one specific thing. <laughs> Let's go back in to, we'll try level 115, like deep. Nothing. Nothing. So we're looking for a purple stone. We can also have iridium in it, which is also good. Alright. Hopefully they spawn, though. They don't always spawn. Nope. 
There's nothing there. These bats are so much easier than the damn things in the skull cabin. The beach, beach kit mine, I mean. Uh, we have, we just cleared the quarry a little bit ago. Uh, there was no prismatic shard in there, unfortunately. It's only a 25% chance for it to spawn, even from the purple nodes. Dead for a day, thank you for the Prime Gaming sub. You love this game? It's fantastic, Hex. There's so much to it now, especially with the update, adding a lot more in-game stuff. Game is legit. Oh, there's a thing right there. Whoops, I didn't see that. This game is legit crack, pretty much. It's hard to quit it. I like the straw hag that's very farmerish. I need to eat my pancakes, I think. Um, it's kind of, there's some similarities between this and Graveyard Keeper, for sure. But Graveyard Keeper is more, you don't really farm very much. It's much more about crafting and stuff. And I think, I find uh, Graveyard Keeper to be far more tedious, at least, especially in the beginning. Um, than this one. This one's more better laid out. The Graveyard Keeper is far more expensive too. It's a more expensive base game and then they also have two DLC packs now. Yeah, Graveyard Keeper is more about the graveyard than um, and building up the landscape, but it's a fun game. If you've never played it, it's pretty, I, I like it. One really bad thing about Graveyard Keeper is that there's only like four music tracks, so you, if you play it for dozens of hours, the songs get welded into your brain, like hardcore. You will hear that damn song over and over and over, and they're, they're really good tracks, really good songs, but my god, they never stop playing, and you hear them over and over again. I need to add like dozens of more songs. Or even do it like what this game does, which is only have the music play sometime. Like the music doesn't play constantly in this game. It's nice when it does though. Well, I can't find it down in here. Oh, secret note, though. <laughs> Leave the mine. All right, let's uh, go home. Oh, we can also check the quarry. Sure, it's respawned a little, but I'd be surprised if we got a mystic stone yet. Nope. Not at all. Alright, let's let's go to bed. Well, tomorrow's gonna be a very short day because um it's Christmas tomorrow. Yeah, the this game releases massive updates for free. Like, entirely. It's, it's nuts. Like, he releases it entirely for free. Because he's just a badass like that. It's, it's, it's hard to find a reason not to support this developer because the game itself was only $20 at launch. And he's never charged DLC for it years later. 
And he releases so much content that could have been a paid expansion that we would have all paid for, but he didn't. He just gave it for free. Here, have all this. I worked on this for a year. Take it. Um, there's only a few older bachelors in town, and none of them are perfect. Harvey really is anxious and weak, but I know he would make a loyal, devoted husband. He likes coffee and pickles. <laughs> Elliot is a bit foppish and melodramatic, but he does have a nice chin. He likes crab cakes and pomegranates. Shane is messy and antisocial, but I think his gruff exterior is a defense mechanism. It's insulating his softness from the world. He likes beer, pizza, and pepper poppers. Well, okay then. Uh, the last update was supposed to be the last update for Stardew, but he, he kept adding to it. It's like, oh, let's let's keep going. <laughs> Progress has been saved. It's Christmas, chat! <laughs> yeah, he released 1.4, which is a big update, and he had no plans of making another one, but then he just was like, oh, I'll just release another one. Why not? It's Christmas again. Christmas part two. Tifa's dead again. Okay. Love, love. I think he loves this game so much that he's probably going to just keep adding on to it forever. Alright, let's make some of my, my world famous mayonnaise. Famous mayonnaise. I put the man in mayonnaise. No, <laughs> that sounds awful. Okay, <laughs> love you, love you, love. Love you, love you, love you, love you, love you. I missed that goat. Don't worry, I love you. Okay, now I will milk you. Or not. So, goats don't need milk today. Only the cows. <laughs> Feast of Winter Vale has star. Not Winter Vale. <laughs> Winter Star. Different game. Wrong game. <laughs> okay, put that, that. I need all of the money. All right, let's go to the Feast of Winter Star. Give her my gift. It's Christmas! Thankful to uh, worry today and relax. You want your secret gift? Yes. Farmer's lunch. So, it's you! Ah, farmer's lunch, thanks.
So I'm your uh, secret gift giver this year. Well, open it. A, you received a bottle of wine. It's nothing fancy, but it's the best I could afford. Mm-hmm. What are you hoping to find under the spirit tree? Um, a pair of stylish boots. That'd be a great gift. Feast for some stupid star humbug. Aren't you fr freezing, dear? It's cold. Oh, hello. Good time of year for it. Not a good time of year for a diet. And for my guitar and my skateboard. I don't want my family, I guess. Hi, Dan. Do you want to hear le le the legend of the Winter Star? Yes. I didn't read it. Whoops. <laughs> I clicked it. That looked like it was semi important. What a beautiful tree. I skipped the lore. Whoops. We'll get the lore next year. Look who's setting up shop and making money even on Christmas. <laughs> Gotta talk to everyone so they get me. They they're happy. <laughs> oh Pierre, ornate window, house plant, dining table, decorative axe, wood log, tree of winter star, manicured pine. None of that is great. I will hold off a bit. I need money for next year. <laughs> Had too much cinnamon nog. Cinnamon nog sounds gross though. Dun, 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 dun. Uh, I think I, I think that's it. Nothing else to do. Unless there's something else to do. I think that was it, right? Okay, well, let's get out of here. It would be nice if we, had, if we like updated the events to make them a little more interesting. And varied each year. I got me a bottle of wine that is amazing, and I love it, and it's so good. Oh, I sold it. Okay, whoops. Whoopsie. Whoopsie daisy. I hate when someone gives you a gift that it just turns into a task. Oh, great. You gave me a chore. Now I gotta take this back and do something else with it. <laughs> it's like, ah. <laughs> Should have just chugged it. I don't want to drink alone on Christmas, alright? I don't want to re I don't wanna I don't want to be like real life again. Wait a minute, can I make apple juice? If I take this make and make apple juice. Oh, yes, that does work. There we go. Okay, sleeping. The wine was 500 gold. Wow. I spend more on cat food for Tifa. Actually, I've never fed her once. Well, Christmas is over. I gotta be a responsible adult now and take down the tree. 
put it away. Hello, Marnie. Good morning, Mr. Dan. Came by to ask you for a favor since you're such a kind neighbor. You see, I'm trying to train my goats to say hello, but they simply won't pay attention to me unless they have their favorite treat, cave carrots. So since I'm scared of the mines, I thought, well, maybe you would bring me a cave carrot when you have the chance? It's no pressure, but if you just want to, swing by my house between 9 a.m. and 5 p.m. with a cave carrot. You'll make an old girl very happy. Bye. Um, okay, I will do that. Hello, um, I'm not taking care of animals, when I'm not taking care of animals, I like to spare in the kitchen. Since we've become friends, I want to share some recipes with you. Hope you like this. Ooh, pale broth. Um, I want to make a fish stew, need some albacore. I know they're almost out of season. Sorry about the short notice. Could you catch one for me? Gus. Sir, I... I had a bunch of albacore. Do I have any left? Nope. I gotta go catch another one. Alright, I gotta do my chores first, though. What? Can a lady ask for my cave care without chat having to be all gross about it? She just wants my cave care, okay? Hello, 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 and hello. And now we milk. you and now we make some cheese there we go she already gets the mayor's cave carrot <laughs> can you guys not no oh, come on silent oil to toaster thank you for the um dandurp 10 month resub. <laughs> hey, Pam. Penny sure does like old books. I think she was heck of a lot smarter than I ever was. Well, that's not a very hard bar, Pam. I gotta see what time it's available. Albacore. Start ale. It is... Until 11 a.m. and then after 6 p.m. So I can catch one from fast. I gotta be real fast.
Nope. Copper ore and two rubies. Lovely, but not what I'm looking for. I'm not sure we're going to romance yet. We'll figure it out. We got time. Spring is a season of love, by the way. Okay, we gotta hurry. Come on, he's one Albacorp. Oh no, it's probably just past. This is an area to wait till 6 p.m. Nope, another red mullet. Boo. Uh, Linus is not romanceable. I don't think. Now that attitude? <laughs> Not with any attitude. You just can't. Alright, take all that. And the clam. Inventory fault. Whoops. It is. Alright, let's go back. Only two days left until it's spring. You started with the beach farm, now you regret everything. I told you. I need an extremely rare and powerful goop known as ectoplasm found in the remains of slain ghosts. Require an assistant in tracking down the rare and dangerous prismatic slime within the local caves. Bring me a jar of its prismatic jelly and you will be duly rewarded. Um, uh-oh. The ectoplasm one is probably easier. Since I know where ghosts are. Deliver an ectoplasm to the wizard. The slime one, I don't know if I've ever seen a prismatic slime. <laughs> The chance of getting the prismatic slime while also having the quest, unless there's some sort of boost in the drop rate, would be very rare. It only spawns if you have the quest. Okay, so that's why. Yeah, I figured there must be some sort of boost, otherwise it wouldn't make any sense. cash to start off the spring. Now, do I have ectoplasm? It must only spawn when I have the quest, so I'll have to go kill a fresh ghost. And let's see what floor ghosts spawn. Um, Stardew Valley. They spawn on floors what? 59 to 79 in the mines. Okay. 51. So 51 to 79. So let's go quickly. Nope, not there. So we gotta go kill some ghosts. Hope we get some ectoplasm. Hopefully we can find a ghost and get some fresh ectoplasm off of it. Yeah, I gotta remember the last day of the season too. I have to check. Oh, there's a ghost. No, 
ectoplasm. No! Well, we'll try the next floor. Hopefully one of these ghosts drops an ectoplasm. Okay, there's another one. Come on now. Come on, ectoplasm. No ectoplasm. Damn. Let's make sure there's not another ghost in this level before we go. Grab a little iron while I'm at it. Okay, I think that's it. These are only one or two on the floor. Okay, another one. Hello. Two. Three. No ectoplasm. Damn. Um, if you need some iron, I'll grab this real fast. I need some copper, too. I need some coal. So that is not bad. Drop rate's around 10%. Oh, no. At least we're getting lots of ghosts. What is this? Oh, this is different. Rare spawn floor. Um, in the regular mine, different floors can sometimes spawn rare versions of the floor. Skeletons have rice seeds on them. I don't know if they have special treasure. Well, we'll have to find out. Thank you. Four, five, six. Okay. We'll see if there's something in the middle. Or not. Uh-oh. One, two, three, four. Dark Sword. 30 to 45 damage, vampiric. <gasps> I got a rare drop. It steals life, apparently. It says vampiric. Slight upgrade, not a massive one, but pretty decent. Minus five speed, though, sucks. sword and cave carrot. Great. I don't see my you don't see my HP go. Well they're probably undead. Maybe you can't steal health from from undead things. You know, cause facts and stuff. Further. 
It says vampiric, but I don't know what that means. It doesn't seem like it's stealing life. Unless it's a chance on hit. So it's a chance on hit, not a guaranteed. Where are my ghosts at, bro? Yeah, I don't know, that sword seems kind of eh. Uh, her request doesn't have a time limit, so I can turn it anytime I want. Come on, ghost. Give me what I want. I think the other sword's better. Because it's so much faster. on this floor either. That sucks. I need a ghost. It sucks the drop rate so low we may not even may not even drop. The first one has to spawn and then one has to drop. Ghosts don't always spawn, that sucks. Gotta go. It's starting to get late. Damn. Let's go back to mine trying to get a, a ectoplasm tomorrow. 